Right, so what you want to do now is before we leave, just make sure you've got um, three spare slots. And we're going to go out here and there'll be a zombie which we're going to gun down. Because we're going to go to this room quite a bit, so. Just gun him down a bit. We haven't got the lighter yet, so we can't burn him. Just top up that ammo. Right, so you want to head up here. If you can dodge this zombie here. Whoa! Shit. That's it. Right, just run past him. through this door here grab the herb I think we'll use that now to heal ourselves Right, so then we want to head back through the door here. Down this hallway again. That's it, try and avoid the zombies if you can. Oh. And head through this door here. That's it. Grab this uh, wooden mount and head down the hall, avoiding the zombie. That's it. Right, now head into the dodge these two. Whoa. Right now head into this door here. Right now you want to get the uh, magazine off of this table. Get the dog whistle here. So you got that. Get the light off the table as well. Alright, so we've got the lighter. Head back through this door where there's probably be some zombies. I'm just gonna get Shotgun equipped. And we can pop these zombies off, and what we'll do, we'll burn them to stop them coming back. That's 
set. And we'll burn these. That should stop them coming back. Well, and set that should just stop them coming back. So then we want to go into this room over here. Light the uh, fire with the lighter. Let's grab the lighter like that. Lovely. And what we want to do is put the wooden mount above the fire, which gives us the uh, map. So then we've got the uh, second floor map then. head back to the save room there's a zombie down here just kill him and burn him as well top up a ker kerosene as well So just top up your kerosene. Lovely. Make sure we've got one spare slot, which we have. Right now we want to head back to where we was before. Towards the way where we got the uh, lighter and stuff through here. Should be two zombies in here. Just dodge these if you can. So there's one, you can dodge him. This one's off camera, so just dodge around him if you can. That's it. Oh! Wow, what am I doing? Shit. Ah, lovely zombies. That's it, just head through this door here. Eh? <laughs> right, they should do a cut scene now. Let's 
There we go, got the acid rails. <coughs> what about you? Oh, don't worry. I like my buddy system we have here. I see. Thanks, I'll take it. Ciao. Alright, so now what we want to do is, uh, head back through these doors here, to the, uh, above the dining room. Alright, then you've got this door on the end, you want to go through this one. So we're in here, you can ignore this door for now. Right, there's a couple of zombies in here, so we want to kill these. Stop him coming back. That's it. And just kill this zombie as well. And what he's doing. <laughs> Stairs. Go through this door here. Oh no, sorry, we want to go out of here. Just ignore that room for a second. Top your kerosene up here. Got the ink ribbon. Oh, right. Take the battery pack, yeah. And then you've got the uh, broken shotgun here as well. So basically, earlier when you got the shotgun, if you went back into the room before you got the shotgun and got the acid rounds off of Barry, you wouldn't have been able to get the shotgun, you would have put it, had to put it back on there. So basically, if you did get the acid rounds early, this broken shotgun allows you to replace the other shotgun. 